The first one, I want to make sure we have some definitions that are correct. So um, first of all, when we're looking at a circle, we talked about a central angle, right? And a central angle was comprised of two radii right, coming together. So a radius, remember, is the distance from the center to the outside, you know, a point on the circle. Now, we know that if I extend that radius in both directions, then we create a straight line across a circle that goes through the center, which we call the <coughs> diameter, right? <coughs> Diameter. Um, now, the, this is a special type of what we call a chord. And the basic definition of a chord is just going to be any line that's two endpoints end on the circle. So a chord is pretty much a straight line. with two endpoints on a circle. All right? So guys, your two endpoints could be, so your two endpoints could be here, right? You could be E, F. It could be G, H. These are all examples of a chord. It could be something like this. S, T. Those are all examples of a chord. All right? Anytime you're drawing a line that has an end, two endpoints on, on the circle, that's going to represent a chord. And remember, the most famous chord that we talk about is the diameter, because there's only, there's only one. You can, all, I mean, you can have the diameter only going one time that's going to go through these two endpoints and go through the um, center. All right? So. Correctamente. And then you say the whole? A, a diameter is a 